Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Oh, okay. So today in this video, the I got the results in from the poll and you guys wanted me to fly from where Melo to Isolarani. So that's what we will be doing today. Let's quickly and as my rank in the group is a cargo pilot, we will be taking a cargo plane. So let's take a Yes, I was able to spawn it quicker than he <laughs> got in quick. We will be taking a FedEx MD-11. Hopefully this isn't too loud over the recording. It shouldn't be. Anyway, I hope you guys have been enjoying the last couple of videos that have been edited by now my editor. I do have a friend of mine who offered to be my editor and I said go for it. So he's been editing the last couple of videos. And they've been turning out very well. So I think today we're just going to start off by immediately taxiing down. But what I need to talk about is some big updates that have happened. They have added taxiway signs. Like, for example, we're now taxiing along Alpha. And then so we're going to continue down along Alpha and hold short of runway uh, oh, 11. We're going to hold short of runway 11 on Alpha. And so they've added a whole bunch of, um, what do you call them? The taxiway signs everywhere. They've got drought, well not drought, ground crew, like the baggage truck, fuel truck, stair truck, airport bus, and even the fire truck, which is a game pass, which I'm probably going to end up buying in the future. All right, FedEx 5954, holding short runway 11. Clear for takeoff. FedEx 9, 5954, taking off runway 11. That dude is in a Delta CRJ. Just completely careening across the taxiway. Alright, here we go. Throttling up. So, as we begin to throttle up. We're going to have a nice smooth takeoff. And then we'll be landing at Isolarani. So I just want to point this out. I'm beginning to plug this. I've, begin, I've begun, begun to plug this in some of my other videos. Is that you guys should join my Discord server. It is linked on my YouTube channel and will be linked. The invite will be linked in the video below. In the video description below. So if you guys went ahead and joined that this Discord server, it'd show that the amount of support that you guys give to the channel. And then also just smashing the like, smashing the subscribe button, and always hitting the notification bell. So keep the notification bell on so you never miss an upload and you're first to view it every time I upload. So the reason the, this FedEx plane is pretty blank is because the creator has had to remove literally all the actual logos or words of the company off the plane for copyright reasons. So I think we're just going to get ready to level out here. So I think I'll put a poll about right here, about where I should fly next. I think I'll give the suggestion um, St. Bartholomew to... Oh, sorry. Uh, St. Bartholomew to Melor. Um, maybe... Pafos to Grindavik, which is on Cyprus Island, or maybe Larnaca to Greater Oxford, just as a normal flight. So we're now cruising at two-ish thousand feet. I'm going to pause the recording and come back once we are over at the nearing the island, or the island that Isla Rani is on. So checking in midway through the flight, we are descending now we're going to throttle back a bit and get ready to join the approach into Isla Rani. So I'll see you once we're on final to Isla Rani pretty much. FedEx 5954 is now on final runway. I think it's, um, no it's not runway 11, I think it's runway 7 maybe? Runway 7? Seven? 7-0? Seven or is it runway, runway zero nine? -er? I honestly can't remember which runway it is. But we're on final to it anyway. 
approach speed's looking good. We're about to come over the final hill. So the annoying thing that I find about flying into Isla Rani is that so you'd be casually descending like normal and then there's this little jut of hill just here and that can catch you off guard pretty quick. So I've always got to be paying attention Under the way for GPWS call outs. Alright, bit of a light landing on that one. Still a pretty good landing. But I was starting to float. We probably touched down about there. We should have touched down pretty much right back at the end of the runway. So we're going to begin... Sorry if I'm talking really fast too, I just noticed that. So we're going to begin to throttle back here. So now we're going to turn on to what looks to be Delta 3. And then we're going to taxi across to the cargo bay. So we're going to turn on to Delta now. So we're going to turn on to Delta and then follow it down on here to turn on to Golf. So yeah guys, as I've said, don't forget to join my Discord server because that really shows that you're supporting the channel. Why is it lagging? That shows that you support the channel. Also smashing the like and subscribing also. That shows that you guys are supporting and loving the channel. As we finish taxiing down here, I'm pretty much going as quickly as you can legally taxi in real life. I'll try and speed it up. Just, there we go. 30 knots is the maximum taxi speed, according to the FAA and regulations of aviation. So we turn on to Golf, I believe it is. Is it? Yes, it was golf, I was correct. So we're going to turn on to golf, as I've said now, like three times. And we're going to pretty much see, and then we're just going to park at, um, we'll go gate 10. Just hitting the, the forward key to get the plane to go a bit faster. All right, as we turn into here, FedEx 5954, we're turning into gate 10 and the runway was runway 10. So I'm just going to put the plane like that, yep, and now we're going to slow down. Well anyway guys, I think that this is going to do it for today's video, or well, this week's video. I hope you have enjoyed. As I've said, join the Discord server, smash the like, smash the subscribe button and hit that notification bell to never miss an upload. Well, anyway, guys, I'd like to thank you. Oh, ouch. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Oh, gosh, this is an awkward outro. See you in the next video. <laughs>